Fred, congratulations. How nerve-wracking was it for you to watch Jim Furyk and Graham McDowell play those last couple of holes? Uh, it was nerve-wracking. I know what kind of players they are. Both have won majors, and um, I expected uh, both of them to do well coming in. And um, you know, I thought even though Graham had a 25 footer, he's probably going to hit the hole or have a good chance. But um, I couldn't be happier right now. And um, you know, congrats to Graham and Michael for playing great golf. You go 68-68 on the weekend, and a burst of three straight birdies and four in a five-hole stretch turned it around for you today. Yeah, that was kind of the difference. I got off to a slow start, but I knew that I'm, I, I, I knew that always something to spice matters up. Yeah, enjoy the gel stuff out. <laughs> um, but no, I knew that um, there were some birdie holes on the back, and I just had to, you know, stay patient. And luckily, the birdies came. Your wife, Dowd, is expecting. She was by your side. You're kind of amused. The, uh, the John Dimes are taking care of this gentleman, and he is on his way to a place other than where you're headed. Um, your, your wife, Dowd, who's expecting, was watching along with you. This is a special time for you in your life. It was. You know, we had a week, uh, just the two of us. Um, our, our little boy's 16 months old, and it's been our first week away from him, so it was bittersweet, but we couldn't have had a better week. And um, I needed her here with me because uh, I never felt nerves like I did today, and a lot of times I kind of had to hit my legs because I couldn't really feel them. Um, but it was, it was a pleasure to have her here, and uh, I couldn't imagine it without her. I mentioned this on the air to you a while back, but those here in the gallery didn't hear it. You are a past winner of the Arnold Palmer Scholarship to Wake Forest, the golf scholarship there. You and Mr. Palmer have a relationship. This is the scene of one of the most bitter defeats of his entire career in 1966 when Billy Casper came from way back and eventually beat him in the playoffs. So there's an irony there, but you were saying earlier, you probably expect to hear from Arnold Palmer to congratulate you. I'd love to. He's meant so much to me, and you know he uh, allowed me to play at Wake four years, and um, you know I've got to know him a little better through the Bay Hill tournament. But you know to to, to win here with what happened to him, uh, I hope he can smile, and I hope he was watching. Congratulations, Wade. Thank you so much. Wade Simpson is your U.S. Open champion. Man. Fifth round and five opening at Olympic, a player comes from behind to win. So that storyline stayed intact. And uh, Johnny, with Webb Simpson winning his first major championship, mm -hmm. uh, what kind of future does this guy have? Well, you know, you're the only.